Hey guys, it's Wednesday, June 21st, and uh, heading out for some summer crop damage. It's my This will be my first time going out for the year at the pumpkin patch. Uh, I know Ben has been out, I think, twice, and he got a couple the other night with his brother. Uh, they were able to sneak up on him in the middle of the field, so I believe they have 12 tags to start with this year. I'll have to double check that with Ben, but I want to say he said 12. Um, so we're going to go up tonight. We got permission. Uh, so we're trying to sneak out here uh, after work and before it gets dark, obviously. Um, it's pretty hot today. I, I want to say it's like in the 90s today. So as usual, um, got to get them quartered out pretty quick and put away so that the meat doesn't go bad. But um, I think it's going to be the three, three of us, uh, myself, Ben, and his brother Kyle. Um, going up there so we've we've talked about maybe trying to divide and conquer tonight because we don't have a lot of time to hunt coming up here uh, we're taking a trip this weekend to go fishing and then um, and then we get into the busy uh, summer vacation schedule so um, gonna try and get as many as possible tonight but um, yeah we'll kind of see as we get up there I know Ben's gonna bring a bow so he can sit in a spot closer to the road and then Kyle and I are going to try and uh, go off on our own, hope probably, and uh, film for ourselves. So, yeah, um, we'll pick it up once we get to there with him. I'm on my way right now to Ben's house, and we'll head out there, see what we see. Just out of range at 165 yards.
Really? Huh. I literally went like this and I just spotted this belly. She was literally so walking. Look at this. Here's blood trail. I perfect shot right in the shoulder. Everything we said. You even shot it in the shoulder. Really? You tried too close to get that good. Did it it was I feel like it was quartering to me. Yeah, either way, big old big old mama. I just don't understand. Oh, just one entry, that's why. Interesting. So it must hit it and it, okay. I bet it either hit in the back leg or because I'm pretty sure it was quartered right to there me. Is a, wait, no, that's a lump. I think that's not the bullet. Oh, bad. That's what I was doing. Oh. I thought that's you were saying right. it smelled already. No, <laughs> no, 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 It's been ten minutes. Well, sweet. I feel like you got a little lucky with that track job, but oh yeah, yeah this is where Kyle shot that nine point. Was it died right, right here? Yeah. And uh, my doe that I shot wasn't it like right over here somewhere it was it was up in here but yeah well I just got back to my house it's about 12 15 we we didn't end up filming much at the end there um the bugs were just horrible and it was hot so we were just trying to get out of there but um as you saw we ended up finding the one um uh, it was the one that I definitely felt the most confident on um that first shot, I, I just kind of rushed it a little bit, and after looking back at the footage, it, I mean, it kind of looks like I, I maybe shot right underneath it. You can definitely see uh, dust fly up in the background as I shoot, and we went and looked all over for blood and walked back through those woods, kind of towards where it ran and didn't find any blood, and looking at the video, it just really doesn't look like it was hit. Um, and like I said, I just, I didn't feel as comfortable uh, with the with the shot anyway, so uh, I didn't hear a hit or anything, which you can kind of hear um, that second shot, the second deer, I definitely heard a hit, so I um, was definitely glad to find that one. Um, like, like we kind of said in the video, there was really not much of a blood trail. Uh, there wasn't an exit hole, so that, that kind of explains why, but it, it looked like it was a pretty, pretty good shot right through the front shoulder, and it was kind of quartered away. We found an exit, or uh, where it had kind of gone through the leg, but it looked like it didn't puncture the skin on the back end, uh, the back leg there. So, um, yeah, we ended up at least getting one and got it quartered up, got it out of there, and uh, we got it. Uh, we Kyle brought it home and put it in his freezer so we can process it later. Hopefully, when we get a couple more later on in the summer, get them all um, turned into burger or. I know Ben was going to make some jerky for this weekend for a fishing trip, so good end of the hunt. Um, we we're kind of hoping to see a few more, but uh, had a few chances and got one down, so uh, I can't ask for much more. And um, I'm going to go to bed now um, and try and not wake up the wife. So <laughs> hope you guys enjoyed the video and, and catch you on the next one.